Howdy everyone, it's your favorite Foxaholic. Welcome to Below the Stone. This game is very recent, it just came out. It is a roguelike, exploration, cave crawling type of game. Uh, this game looks really fun, so I figured why not do an episode on it, you know? Do a video. So, uh, let's hit play. Uh, let's create a character here. Muldorm. Let's see what we got. One, two, three, four. Uh, well, that's all we got. Um, this one's kind of cool. Beard? Um, no beard. Body. Oh, we got colors. Hair color. I think that looks like me. Create character. Are you sure that's how Muldorm looks like? Yes. All right. Are you ready to go below the stone and make a name for yourself? Yes. All right. So the first thing that this game does remind me of is, of course, enter the gungeon. Uh, what do we got? Ah, yes, we've made it. Welcome to the old halls of the Dwarven Kingdom. This area is usually off limits to rookies like you, but I have a mission for you to do. Okay, I, I get it. So I got a soup ladle. Beautiful, beautiful. It does not look like tools have durability, which is good. Unless it's just like that because it's like a starter tool or, um, you know, the tutorial or something. Where am I going here? I found a secret. What is that? Viking helmet. Resistance 1 versus resistance 6. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Get some light in here. So it looks like there's a, like a goblin or an orc. Ooh, ooh. Damn, he died with two smacks on the face with a soup ladle. Ooh. Okay, so it seems like uh, this white line here is like my range. I'm assuming. Open up this chest. A key? Oh, fuck. Ay! Back off, you stinking vile creature. Don't come any closer. I don't let kobolds touch my beard. Oh, is that a fellow dwarf? Sorry, my visor's given me some height and smell over the years. And I guess by your smell you've already dealt with them? That means I'm free to have my dignity back. Get it? Dignity? <laughs> oh my good god. We got like an entire fucking thing going on in here. Alright, let's 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 start with with you. Since you were the first dude. I was expecting you. What do you have for me today, if anything? Do you have it? Do ya? Maybe not. Anyway, let me see what you have. Across the top here, you can filter the list by crafting materials. Or more importantly, you can hide all the junk you can't craft yet. How about we get you started with some torches? Take this piece of coal and some wood. It's not smart to mine without a light, you know. Uh, okay. A crossbow would be actually really nice. I'm gonna craft one. Can't you see I'm doing important banking work? What do you need? Wait a minute. You're one of those new recruits, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Well, let me tell you something. You new recruits need to be sure to store things here, otherwise we'll have lost everything you acquired. Let me show you the vault. I'm sure you'll get a hang of things simply by stepping inside. Oh, shit. So if we die... Oh, right, because it's a roguelike. So if we die, I'm pretty sure we lose... We... We might keep what's on our hotbar, but lose what's in our bag, or we just might lose everything. I, I don't know how it works yet. Uh, okay, looks like we got like a potion person and healing person. There's there's some there's some persons. Welcome, little one. I'm an alchemist by profession, and I'm able to prepare you pretty much anything you wish for, as long as you provide the ingredients. Uh, okay. Well, I don't need any of that. Yes, <laughs> 
I am mean, you you find this traitor in the kingdom. If anyone says otherwise, the lie. Some of you guys come to my shop every day, so if you see something else, you might not see it the next time if you're here. So be sure to grab anything that catches your eye. But don't forget to pray, of course. <laughs> or well, my price is just my double. Anyway, have a look around. Hey there! Uh, yes, you, that dang darn blurry blob moving all around over there. Come a bit closer so I can see you. That's right, closer. Hi, look! Confess, you drawer explorer. I didn't see one of you and Jake's boys come back. I can read. I don't know how to read. You're going into the caves, my condolences. I'm the foreman around here. Been so for 96 years. Yeah, that's right. Well, let me tell you, in all my darn years at this gate, not a single ding darn dwarf is left without a proper list of work to do. Uh, this is tiring, bro. All right, so we got some quests. Uh, can I accept multiple? Grab a quest or three and start. Okay, so I can probably do all of these. Um, collect ten. Let's do. Let's, can I just, ex oh, okay. So three's the max. Um, let's do these three. Oh shit. All right. So, so here we are. Um, welcome to the caves. Explore around and see what you find. But remember, you can't leave the caves unless you complete at least one of your missions. Oh shit. Okay. Just one more swing. Show those youngins you still got it going. I never seen your face around here. You one of them new recruits or something? Oh wait, you're that dwarf who saved the blacksmith, right? He's my little brother. Shame getting caught by some kobolds and he needed some newbie to save his beard from being scalped. He probably hit you with the, you digging these puns? All these tiny little things. So I can interact with this, but it doesn't seem to do anything. It's It's probably not like fully grown if that's there is something shining in here hold up hold up what's going on in here oh we really digging now oh is it just shining because there's um some coal yo holy fuck this place is oh we can swim oh what the fuck Are those fingers? Oh shit, we found a uh, little stronghold type of thing. Oh my god. Alright, we're good. We're good. Alright, we got some chests here. I don't know what that is. We got some shotgun shells. We got a head. We have a head. Oh, those are potatoes. I don't know if there's like a limit to these these maps and levels or if they just go you know what i mean oh shit oh shit oh shit oh shit oh shit we caused the cave in this guy's in you just skeleton, oh my goodness. Oh hell yeah, he drops fucking arrows. Slimes! Okay, five more, uh... Medium ones. Let's put some stuff in here. What in the hell is that? Some kind of frog. Oh shit, we got like some amethysts or something there. But I don't have a strong enough pickaxe. I can't mine that either. I just need two more medium slimes, man. Is this one? I think this is one. One more. And then I can leave. I mean, I can leave now, but... 
I really want to complete all three of these. Let's call. Oh, that was spooky. Oh, shit. So it's like a mix of Escape the Dungeon and fucking Deep Rock Galactic, where you gotta like guard your exits and your and your your pod. Oh, this is actually bullshit. Oh, this is actually bullshit. I did it. I did it. I'm amazing. Let's get the hell out of here. We made it. You have successfully survived your first cave descent. Please enjoy the demo for as long as you'd like. Your progress will be saved here at the kingdom if you launch the demo again. If you enjoyed playing, sign up to our newsletter on the main menu. All right. We got 200 fucking dollars. Some copper, I, I believe. And emerald shards. I don't know what the shards do. You probably like melt them down into a full gem. Um, but seriously, where do I sell shit? All right. We got a, an upgrade to our stuff. Go ahead and... Um, I guess if tin's not that great, we don't really need it, huh? Oops. Also, this this uh, short sword really reminds me of Terraria. I I guess I can go back in. Um, but I think as far as you know, proceeding with content and everything, um, this is probably where it stops because you know, being a demo and everything. So yeah, that was uh below the stone. I definitely want to play the full game. I I really enjoyed the little bit that I played of it. It seems super awesome. I love the art style. I love the concept. If you want to play it yourself, go ahead. It's on Steam. If you enjoyed the video, that's not the outro. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you dislike the video, give it a dislike. That's okay too. I will catch you in the next one.